Well, it's mid-January and I'm on Barmouth Prom at the moment. In the next couple of minutes, I'd like to show you a house about 100 yards up the road there at 7 Princess Avenue. It's a great renovation project for somebody and I hope the sun's shining by the time you move in. So apart from the fantastic location, about 100 yards away from the beach or so, this house offers you a fantastic opportunity to really work your way up the housing market a bit. It needs quite a bit of renovation. I also want to use this opportunity to try and make sure that you can appreciate what you're going to be taking on. So let's go inside and have a look around. We're so close to the beach, I can hear the waves even from the front garden here. Let's get inside in the warmth. Come on then, Rube. Come on, you can come in here. Come on then. Now the good thing is, as soon as you come in here, you can feel the warmth of the gas-fired central heating. There's a few radiators about the house, so that straight away makes it quite livable. Off to the left of the hallway is the lounge and there's lots of double glazing here as well. At the front here, beyond the garden, there's an open outlook across the playing fields towards the, the sea and the beach. This is the separate dining room that's at the rear of the house. But it's when you get to the kitchen here that you start to see that there's a bit more to do here than just a bit of redecoration. The kitchen does need refitting. And also, if we look in the pantry cupboard here, Straight away, you'll see that any electrician is going to tell you that there's quite a lot of upgrading needed here. And as we go right to the back of the house, this rear porch provides a utility area and also a downstairs toilet. However, it's very much secondary accommodation. It's only single skin brickwork and also the roof is leaking. So it really just provides you with a porch which gives you access to the really good back garden, which I'll take you out to now. Now this back garden really gives you something that even if you spent tens of thousands of pounds more money in Barmouth, you might not get. It's south facing, there's this attached workshop here, there's a sectional garage which needs a bit of uh, work and improvement, but there's also an off-road car parking space as well. So gardens, parking and a garage are fantastic attributes to have if you're buying anywhere in Barmouth. Well I'm kind of back inside in the warm so let's have a look upstairs next. As well as having really good gardens here the house itself has also got a really practical family layout with three bedrooms and a bathroom all off this landing. This is the bathroom. It's got a white suite, double glazed window, I think I could live with this for some time whilst I was preparing to upgrade it in the future. This is the double bedroom at the back and once again I can vouch for the heating. It's lovely and warm in here even though it's about 6 or 7 degrees outside in the wind. This is the front single bedroom and that's the boiler where all that lovely warmth is coming from. Out the front window here there's also a sea view. The other bedroom at the front here is also a good double and that's got a sea view as well. So that's Seven Princes Avenue in Barmouth. To sum it up, I think if you put in the effort over the first two years of owning this house, you'll have a home that will take you decades to grow out of and a position that you'll remember forever. So if you want to come and have a look for yourself, I'm Andy Sanderson, this is Ruby here. Give me a call on this number here, 01341 281 599. Hopefully we'll make an appointment and I'll meet you up here in the sunshine on a later day. Thanks for watching and bye bye for now.